Why there? Uh, first off, I just love the community feel. It just, when I first, this first time I stepped on campus, everybody just made it feel like home right away. So I just felt comfortable overall just with just the coaches. It wasn't just like nobody would just like pick in favors. It just like everybody just felt like as one family there. It really felt home, only two hours away. Opportunity for my mom, dad to come see me play. So it was really good overall. So I had a really good experience there. All right, I mentioned about the facilities, and I'm, you're telling me, I'm not telling you anything you haven't noticed yet yourself. Uh, for that level of football, those are some nice oh, facilities. How, and how did that play in? 100%. Like, when I went there, I was just like, I wasn't expecting like nothing too big because I didn't know that much about UND when I first went there. But when I went there, it was amazing. The facility big, two indoor, two indoor facilities for football practices. I love it. It's like a big campus. For a private school, it's a really big campus. So I really love the field, the small town field, 10 minutes away from downtown. So I like it. Okay. Was there something about them that stood out over everybody else that was after you? Well, pretty much. Well, I'm not even going to say it wasn't too many people after me. It was like a slow process just with the transfer portal, all that real slow process. But just, I just, just thank God through the process overall and just really just trying to stay focused on my family. All my friends are sticking by me and everything like that. So it was just really just them. They've been with me since the end of my sophomore year. So. It was O-line here. Is it going to be O-line there? Of course. I'm playing center. All right. Which guard? Or tech? Or which way? I, could play, I could play guard and center. Either way. <laughs> either way. You don't care? No, I don't matter, as long as I get to play. Absolutely. That's all I want to do. Have they told you that might happen quick? Yeah, they did. They said I have a chance to earn my opportunity quickly. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go in there as soon as I can, work my butt off, and try to do what I can to get that starting job. Uh, what about the academics? What's the plan there? Oh, academics? Of course. I'm going to maintain my grades. That's very big in my household, is maintaining grades. I'm not too worried about that because I know as long as I stay focused, it's going to be smooth selling. One more, more I'm in the skill to study. Yeah. Uh, I'm thinking about going into broadcasting or sports medicine, but mainly I'm going to start broadcasting because they have a good broadcasting field right now. So. Good, good you got to fight for it, man. Yeah. <laughs> you got another teammate joining you. Uh, what's that going to be like just playing at the next level? Well, it's just going to be fun just having that bond that I carried for four years. Uh, it's just like a really good experience. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm happy. I'm excited. I'm just see, happy to see what the journey holds. So another chopper ready to go. A good year for you guys. How do you think uh, this, this high school career has kind of prepared you for the college level? Well, if you know Snyder football, you know it's very tough, very hard. Well, I just feel like it's going to over, like overall prepare me really well for the next level. I'm excited. Coach Timman did a great job with us my four years, just preparing us, being hard on us, still love us. So I just really think I'm going to be ready, ele elevate my game at the next level. The long process of uh, picking schools is finally over. You got your support with you. How's the day feeling for you? It feels good. It feels good. I got everybody here. I got my friends, family, got my girlfriend here, I got my dad, mom. It's good. Life's good right now.